Hi, this is Steve Spence with ArduinoTronics.blogspot.com and today we're showing off the RFID reader. We have a SaneSmart RFID card connect to a SaneSmart Uno and we have a Keys RGB LED module. Here we have three different RFID cards so I will grab one of those cards and if you look at that RGB LED module I will wave the card and it turned green. That means the door has just opened. I'll take the other RFID card, wave the card and it turns red. That means that code was not accepted. It's not in the database. I take the key tag, I wave the key tag and again we have green. It shows that that key tag was accepted. Uh, my key tag, I've written on here the code, it's 25. And this card is 60, and that one's accepted. And this one here is 133, and that one is not accepted. If we come over here, we'll see the card number showing hello Steve or hello Linda depending on the number Linda's 25 60 is Steve and the incorrect card 133 we didn't have in the database so the code rejects that card as unknown or incorrect so the door would not open now this has a lot of different possibilities you can use it for access as I've just described here for opening up an electric door strike uh, you could use it for counting um, a value of an object so different cards could have different values and then you could uh, um, tabulate those in a database you could use these for time clock cards keep track of who entered at what time we have a real time clock module that we did another tutorial on I can add that to this so it would do a time and date stamp of what card was used at what time um, either for uh, uh, payroll functions or access functions. So it'll open the door and then it'll keep a log of who entered and when they entered. So there's a lot of different uh, things that you could use this for. But I wanted to put together a simple tutorial. Uh, there was a lot of different pieces of code out on the internet. Some worked, some didn't. Um, some would just dump all the data from the card and uh, I finally found one that actually gave useful information and then I was able to modify it to uh, use my LED and read my and give the values of my cards and simulate a electric door strike opening or closing. Um, I could also add a buzzer to this and give a little tone for a good read or a eh for a incorrect or refused read. But uh, that I'll wait for another day. So thank you for uh, enjoying this. Um, I will post the code, schematic, and other information on arduidotronics.blogspot.com and the exact URL will be in the description of the video. Thank you for watching.